How's it going guys? Welcome back to the channel and welcome to another episode here of Madden 22 with the New York Jets and Zach Wilson. There we look at the stats of the 3,000 passing yards. I don't like to see the interceptions though. But right now we're going against the Miami Dolphins who I believe they're like 5-5 five and five here in the season. So, you know, they're struggling here but uh, they're trying to get a win over. The number one team, the New York Jets, who are 8-1 here in the season. Trying to improve to 9-1. Finds a wide open man. Huge game right here in the opening drive. Able to find his favorite target receiver here. This time, man, that was huge game right there. Christopher Herndon, the tight end. I think we can consider him our favorite tight end here of this team. Although my favorite receiver would be Corey Davis. That's the guy that gets all the targets here. Wilson, can't able to get it away from the pressure. Takes the sack. Coleman, forcing a loss of 10 here. Come on, man. Come on. We can't be getting sacked like this on the opening drive. Wilson, oh, one hand to grab, who else, none other than Corey Davis with 1,250 receiving yards right here, now 1,300 yards in the season for Corey Davis, huge gain, now here getting close to the red zone at the 25, Wilson takes the snap and he's sacked again, Loss of five on the play. We're not liking this right now. We're in trouble. Two sacks already here in the opening drive. We're getting yards. Wilson throws deep and it drops. It was a 50-50 ball here. But I feel like Corey Davis had the advantage here. But he just dropped it. He just dropped it. So now third and 15 here from the 30. Here we go. Wilson releases, finds a man, gets some yards. Jameson Crowder with a huge play right here. This was a huge catch that he made right now. It was a third and line situation. We got the protection that we needed. And then perfect throw. Oof. After having a perfect throw, that could have been a disaster right there. I don't blame the coach for being furious right now. That could have been a disaster. So we're gonna hand it off here to our running back. Gets blocked, and he just short a yard of getting into the end zone. So third and goal here from the one. What can we do here? Come on, let's get the blocks. This has been a long drive just to end it in a field goal and he's in for the touchdown. New York able to get some points here on the opening drive now to see the defense can get some points, can turn the ball over or at least force a stop here, but we'll see. So it looks like the Dolphins were able to get some points here on their opening drive so now here we are in our second drive here of the game from the 25 Wilson quick release Corey Davis with the catch and the first down last game he had 12 receptions 294 yards two touchdowns this guy is having a great season for himself right now but let's get this drive going we're now here at the start of the second quarter it's a four point eight here for the Jets. Seven to three here. Our opening drive resulted in a touchdown. Now we're still trying to get some points here in our second drive here of this game. Uh, right now we're going to throw an incompletion here. Corey Davis again, the intended receiver. Of course, who else can I trust besides him? Well, we have a, cu a couple tight ends that I can trust, but uh, still, not our number one priority. Again, Davis with another grab here. Wilson 6 for 9, 125 passing yards here in this game. 
You know, we have thrown like over 20 touchdowns in this season, but we still have a pretty good amount of interceptions. 12 interceptions here. So the struggles have been there. Here we go. I mean, <sighs> we just missed him. He was wide open. Man. Seth Wilson can be accurate, and there's moments where he's going to be just missing a wide open receiver. And that was the case right there. But this time, he connects with Keelan Cole for the touchdown. And Wilson able to lead the Jets to another successful drive here. A wide open Keelan Cole. What a catch and what a touchdown. Yeah. Now let's see if the defense can get us another stop here. So our defense was able to get the job done, getting the stop. Now we're here on the field with their offense for the third time. Wilson finds a tight end here. Christopher Herdon, good yardage right there. Getting us the first down and a little extra more. Let's go. Still four minutes and 20 seconds remaining here in the first half. Wilson feeling the pressure. Finds a wide open Corey Davis. He tries to, oh! Oh, able to break some tackles. And he's finally brought down at the 25 yard line. Huge gain right there. Man, we got rid of the ball just in time. Zach Wilson was about to take the hit right there. But again, able to release the ball on time. Wilson going deep to the end zone and he finds a win for the touchdown. Jamison Crowder with this fifth receiving touchdown of the season. What a beautiful pass and what a catch. Plenty of room for Crowder to make the grab. Able to maintain his feet in bounds. And the touchdown. Man, three drives, three touchdowns. Let's go. We have now hit the two minute warning and we're here at the 30 yard line of defense yet again with another, another successful stop. Wilson throws a dime to Christopher Herndon for the touchdown and the Jets will increase their lead here. What a throw that was and what a catch. Man, we're just throwing dimes today. Uh, I mean, we did miss a, a wide open receiver early on today. But today, we're just playing some great football right now. Throwing dimes for receivers, making catches here. Now let's see if the defense can get something here. Now, they're going to give us the ball back. So let's see what we can do with a minute left here. Here we go. We still got... One timeout left. Wilson sacked. Let's see what we can do, man. Oh boy, hurry up, offense. One minute left. Here we go. Wilson takes the snap. Wilson releases. Finds it. Open Corey Davis. Hurry up, offense. I think we should go deep now. Let's go deep. We're really feeling it right now. We're really feeling it. Ooh, gets hit. Ooh. Scary, scary situation that was. So fourth down. We're not going to risk it. Let's go for it. Let's punt. So we're now here in the second half. The Dolphins are down here. 3-28. to 28. What an incredible first half for Seth Wilson. 306 passing yards in the first half. 306 passing yards and three touchdowns. And we're just here, getting started here with the second half here, our opening drive. The Dolphins were not able to get any points. Here we go. Corey Davis gets some extra yards, takes it to the 24 yard line. 1,400 receiving yards here for Corey Davis. Leading the lead, not just in receiving yards, receptions, maybe even touchdowns. So he's leading the category, every category possible when it comes to our receiver. Wilson finds a man down the middle. The running back. Michael Carter able to make the catch. I thought the defender was going to get there in time, make the hit. 
you know, and knock the ball out of his hands. But that was not the case. He was still able to get some extra yards there on the play. But here we go. A new set of downs. Wilson to the end zone. Touchdown. Number four. Gary Wilson. And Christopher Hearn having a game for himself. That's his second touchdown of the game. Another perfect throw there by Sack Wilson. What a way to open the second half and with another touchdown. So it looks like the Dolphins were able to get some points here on this last drive. But right now here in the fourth quarter, we have the ball in our hands. Wilson finds Holy Davis. For another huge game, 20 for 26. Exactly 400 passing yards here for Sack Wilson. Man, what a game we're having right here for our offense. Let's keep it going. This has been a really good drive for us here. Now at the 15 yard line, Wilson runs it himself. There we go, about a gain of six yards right there. Gain of six and a run by Wilson, second and four situation from the nine. Still 326 here left in the fourth quarter. So that's the plenty of time for us to keep on scoring here. Wilson finds Corey Davis for another touchdown. Corey Davis with his 11th touchdown of the season. What a phenomenal season this guy's having. Wow. This defense just straight up struggling all game long. 421 passing yards here for Sack Wilson. Five touchdowns in this game. No interceptions. This might be like, if, as far as I can remember, this might be the first game without an interception here for Sack Wilson. So we've had a very, very successful passing game. The running game pretty well as well. 12 carries here for um, Michael Carter. 72 rushing yards. Man. What can I say? The defense played amazing. Only allowed 17 points here in this one. A 42 to 17 in the final score. We will improve our record to 9 and 1. So New England has been the only team that has gotten a win over us. But that's in the past. Right now we're focused on the future. The Jets pulled the win here against the Miami Dolphins. Look at the stats, man. Now we're close. Oh, boy. But anyways, guys, it's going to be it for this one. I hope you guys did enjoy it. If you did, make sure to show some support to the channel. Hit the subscribe button. Leave a like. I would greatly appreciate it. But I will see you guys in the next one. Stay tuned for more. Peace.